Let's just see who was in the Opta team looking at the stats. We've got um, Alistair um, Dickinson, who, uh, at loosehead prop. We've got the Leonardo Geraldini, who made the squad at hooker. We've got England's Dan Cole. Of course, Dan made the second most turnovers of any player in the championship. Going into the second row, Luke Charteris. What a fantastic tournament. He's had 31 tackles on his own for Wales against Ireland. He was joined by Johnny Gray in the second row. And then, of course, the back row, O'Mahony, Robshaw and Vunipola. Vunipola earning the Star Award, the Gold Award, for being the best forward in the tournament. Most carries, most metres made uh, and most defenders beaten. So that is the forwards. Ugo, you're going to come and give me a hand with the backs because I need a bit of help. Who were the star players in Accenture in the backs? Well, it was made up of three guys from England, three guys from Ireland, as you'd expect, and uh, one Scotsman. And we'll start with Conor Murray. He was stand out there. I mean, he made over 150 passes more than any other scrum half in the tournament. Obviously, key to everything which Ireland do, but not just an attack and defence as well. Made more, than, more turnovers than any number nine. Yep. As well as that, George Ford, we'll have a look at him. Outstanding tournament for him, his first ever Six Nations. Top point scorer, and he certainly gets the golden, golden boot as well as our golden award as well. And he made seven assists, more than anyone within the tournament. Rob, um, Robbie Henshaw at 12, quite clearly. Jonathan Joseph, well, he's been a revelation. We're mm, talking about Manu Tuolangi earlier. I mean, his defenders beat him 14, which is unbelievable. And seven clean breaks in the last five games. So he really added to the tempo and the yeah. fluidity of everything that England really did. Um, at 14, we've got Tommy Bow. And at number 15, our lonely Scotsman, Stuart Hogg, made more metres than anyone else with 442 and beat 20 defenders throughout the tournament. So, uh, incredible performances from these guys throughout the tournament. Well, that's our, that's our Accenture team in the tournament, Bafes.